they sent me a chair. Welcome back to the Brannon No D channel. That's right, this is the Brannon No D channel. I'm sure a lot of you probably thought, is this really a legit No D video? We cover earbuds, headphones, Bluetooth speakers, and even neck fans once in a while. Does he do chairs on the channel? The answer to that question is yes, I absolutely do. Today, we're gonna to be covering the Coast Executive desk chair that fully reclines into a complete numified bliss. Yep, that's right. It's a California-based company called Kennels. Full disclosure, they sent out the chair to me to give you guys a review, but I promise you it has no influence on my opinion throughout this review. And the best part, my ass has been sitting in this chair for over two months. Oh my so gosh. yeah, it's been through the test. Oh. So let's get started. Oh, and I promise you, we will not be paying sticker price today. We have unbelievable discounts on this Coast recliner or any other chair that you guys choose. And believe me, there are many to choose from. Now, as you guys notice that box, in my living room was gargantuan. You should have seen me trying to bring that thing in from the porch. I, I skipped the video for that. We didn't have the time. That box with all the parts and everything weighs 92.6 pounds just by itself. It's quite cumbersome. As far as parts go, you're gonna get an AC adapter. That's right, you can plug it in. You'll also get this shiny gas lift cylinder, five PU casters, just kidding, and an aluminum alloy five-star base. And then you get the chair, which is already assembled right out of the box. And that's it, guys. Let's go over the specs on the materials and how this thing is put together. It is quite impressive. Let's talk about how much weight this chair supports. The Coast Recliner's payload will support up to 500 to 600 pounds. That's pretty large. The materials are 100% cowhide. And let me tell you, it definitely smells like leather. Just under the leather is this internal construction of thickened solid wood, multi-layered board. The seat is filled with soft cotton. That feels good on the tush. Ooh. The rest of the materials are of metal and alloy aluminum. Oh, and some cables that you'll have to put together uh, during assembly. As far as the dimensions go, it's 22 inches deep by 21.65 inches wide by 47.24 inches high. The Kennels Coast Recliner is an ergonomic design with strong waist protection, a soothing lumbar spine, supporting the shoulders, fitting the lumbar, and supporting the tail vertebrae. Now that sounds like a chair that any chiropractor would approve. The soft and comfortable backrest greatly relieves stress. Now, of course, this is their words, and normally I would say not mine, 
But I'll be damned if they didn't nail this one because I have been sitting in it and I have been using it for over two months. And I'm here to tell you, you can literally fall asleep in this. You're gonna get independent control with their dual motors. You'll be able to move the footrest in and out to rest those dogs after work. Oh man, to get your legs and feet elevated. Not only that, you'll also be able to control the backrest from a 90 degree angle all the way back to a luxurious 170 degrees. Nighty night, Elmo. <laughs> Another sweet feature is the built-in battery that you can charge when not in use. That's right, with that AC adapter I showed you, you don't always have to have it tethered to the chair. How many times have we had a mechanical chair that you have plugged in and you go to spin or turn and you rip that cord out of the wall socket? <laughs> It's not pretty. This, just charge it up when you're not using it, unplug it when you do. Now I gotta say, coming from an E1 racing chair and then switching from that into the Secret Labs chair that I've been working in for well over two years now. Now going to the Coast Recliner was a humongous change for me. It was like taking a kitchen table chair and swapping it out for a leather Lazy Boy. Oh so yeah, gosh. when we're talking comfort, it goes without saying, but I sit at a desk and do quite a bit of editing for all these reviews I put out, right? So I'm at the computer for hours and hours on end. So it begs the question, do I keep the Coast Recliner here in the studio with me or do I go back to the secret lab? Let's talk about my pros and cons and we'll figure it out together. Normally I start out with the pros always first and then I run into the cons. Today's gonna be a little different guys. We're gonna start out with the cons and roll ourselves into the pros. Con number one, it doesn't rock. Yeah, that's right. We can't rock back and forth, okay? It only swivels. Con number two, it does not sit up straight enough for when I'm at the computer, on the keyboard, editing. And quite frankly, it's just plain too damn big for my size studio. Lastly, it is way out of most people's, like myself, budget. With that being said, Allow me to present the pros. Pro number one, it is absolutely by far the most comfortable chair my butt has ever sat in. And that's including any Lazy Boys I've ever sat in or any furniture stores that I've been to and sat in their most plush leather chairs I could find. Pro number two, definitely going to the premium build quality and the materials. I'm telling you, when you sit in this recliner, it forms the shape of your body. Even the smell. When I walk into the studio, it's the first thing you smell. You smell that fresh cowhide leather and you just know it's of high quality. You just know. And the five casters you get when you're sliding across the floor is buttery smooth. And of course, another pro is the dual motor control for the backrest and the footrest. It just makes the perfect chair package. So the question is, what did I decide? Now, with you guys hearing my cons versus my pros, of course, you're not gonna really help me make the decision because you have not planted your behinds in this chair. And yes, the chair still sits here in the studio. It's been here for the two months. I wanted to give it the full test, see how it wears, if it tears, all the above. So far, so good. Now, I can take this chair out and bring back the secret lab. No problem. However, guys, when I sat in the secret labs after using this for two months, it felt like sitting on a piece of plywood. I mean, sure, it's smaller. Yes, much smaller, not as big, doesn't take up near as much room. And yes, the back of the Secret Labs puts me at the perfect sweet spot for editing. But after using the Kennels Coast Recliner for over two months now, the Secret Labs could have five more better features. This, my friends, is staying right here. Allow me to show you personally how it fits. It's the softest leather I have ever felt from the seat to the back lumbar all the way up to the headrest. And the beauty of this, if you're as messy as me, like a slob, and you spill something on it, you can easily wipe it down with a wet cloth. It's that simple. All right, let's go ahead and put myself in it. Now you're looking at about a five foot six and a half 
five foot seven, I like to tell my wife, she don't believe me. Uh, pushing 200 pounds, yeah, I know, I don't like to brag, but uh, it is what it is. This is basically what a five foot six guy, 200 pounds, looks like in this chair. And I'm telling you, I've got plenty of room. The armrests, I would have to say they're like extra large, if you will, because anywhere you set your arms, you are going to hit the sweet spot on this chair. Guaranteed. And if you were wondering, does it swivel? Absolutely. Gotta have a chair that swivels, you know. Gotta be able to swivel it. And like I said earlier, the wheels on this glide so smooth. Love that. Nice and quiet. And again, it's on a hardwood floor, of course. Carpeting, it does just fine too, because I do have a piece of carpeting right here that I've slid it on and it works just as well. All right, let's cover the features real quick. On the left side, you have this metal bar, right? When I release it, I'm going to drop just like that. So this is at the very end of our ropes right here. Feet touch the ground, no problem. And if you want to raise it up, you stand up and just pull the lever and the gas piston pushes it up. So this is as high as it goes. Of course, it does not rock. I kind of wish it rocked. That would be absolutely perfect. I like to kind of rock back and forth as well as swivel. This, however, does not rock. All right, let's cover the right side. Here you'll have a USB-A port. That's right, you can charge your phone in this thing as well. Next to that, you have your dual motors up and down. First one is the footrest. You guys ready? This goes kind of slow, by the way. I wish they had a speed that you could adjust, like slow, medium, and fast. That would be pretty cool. But nonetheless, you are able to rest them legs. I love the fact that the leather fills the entire area for your calves, feels wonderful, and you are gonna be able to kick your feet up and stay a while for sure. Now the speed of it going down is much faster and I wish it was like reverse. I wish it went up faster and maybe came down slower. Now let me show you the recline. This is ridiculous. You guys ready? Oh, we are going way back. Look at this, guys. Ah, oh. oh. now tell me, tell me you wouldn't be able to fall asleep like this, right? I mean, this thing is a bed slash workhorse of a chair. And that's as far as it goes up. I wish it sat up just a little bit further to have myself up at the keyboard. But again, we are talking a recliner, and a recliner reclines, okay? So that's what you're gonna get with a chair like this. It's gonna recline, it's going to be extremely comfortable, but also very supportive for your back, and your feet, and your legs. First and foremost, I am not sponsored or endorsed through Kennels, okay? They reached out to the channel, gave me their website, told me to pick out a chair. That's the chair I picked, and that was the chair they sent. That being said, I'll be dropping you down my Amazon affiliate link. That's right, I get a kickback. It's not huge, but it definitely helps me and the channel grow in making these reviews for you. I'll also be dropping you the Kennels official link. Guys, you gotta check out their website. They got an abundance of beautiful premium chairs for you to check out. They also have desks and furniture as well. On the thumbnail, you see the list price for 2,295 smackaroonies. Oh, that hurts to even say. Now you're not gonna pay that. On Amazon, you can get it right now for $18.95 even, and they even throw you in a 12% coupon before checkout. Yeah, you'd think, oh, whoop de doo 12%. Well, 12% on $18.95 comes to $227.40 off, making the chair $1,667.60. That is your best savings right now is to actually find it on Amazon with that slashed price and the 12% off. However, you can get on Kennel's direct link because there is such a bigger variety of their chair styles. And if you happen to find that particular one that you fall absolutely in love with, I have a personal code. That's right. Type in Brannon15 and you'll get an extra 15% off on any of the retail prices of each and every chair. I've done my part. Now it's time for you to do yours. Let's open a fortune cookie. Woo! It's kind of crazy with this thing. All right, the word of the fortune is fish. 
you have the ability to touch the lives of many people. Yes, I actually do have that ability. Right here with my channel. Yeah. All right, guys. This is a short and sweet video. There's not much to talk about when it comes to chairs. But as much comes with this chair is a lot you'll be talking about when you get one. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. Don't forget to subscribe on your way out that door if you're not already. Guys, I'll be seeing you in my next video.